Preparing for the possible impacts of a tropical storm, Elsa. News for Jack's reporter Renee Beninati is joining us live from Neptune Beach. So the look at how they're getting ready out there at the beaches, Renee. Kent, drive through this Neptune Beach neighborhood and you will see pile after pile of debris like this one in front of homes that are made up of tree branches and even parts of tree trunks from people preparing from the storm. Mary Houlihan has lived nearly her whole life in Neptune Beach. She tells me she's been through her fair share of hurricanes. Dora in 64 when it was the worst one we've ever had. Houlihan doing what she can before Elsa. Crews trimmed the trees that surround her home, and she was taking matters into her own hands, clipping hedges Monday. Houlihan says she's learned the importance of preparing before the storm the hard way after one of her trees toppled onto her roof. Two years ago, we had to have a huge crane come out here on the other side of the house because it was over, and it took them a, oh, a day, and they sent two crews out. Tim McIntyre also lives in Neptune Beach and was following suit. Yeah, I trimmed up a few trees and threw some stuff away, you know, so it doesn't blow around in the storm. And actually, there was a bigger pile there, but the city came by and got it. The two not too stressed about Elsa, but they say it is always best to be prepared for the worst. I'll just make sure I got water and some non-perishables and, you know, make sure I always got gas in my tank. Just, just hope I'm thankful we didn't have one last year. That's what I'm thankful for. Business owners say right now is the perfect time to make sure that you have everything that you need at the beginning of the hurricane season. We'll break down some of the essentials that they say that you should get coming up tonight at 11. Reporting live from Neptune Beach, Renee Beninati, Channel 4, The Local Station.